Did we all salute? Yes, they did. All of our salutes were like that. <laughs> Since 1993, women have served in the Royal Navy on an equal basis with men. At HMS Rally, they make up one in every ten recruits. Recruit Dark, Cormelo 5, Starboard, reporting Montrose Mess for your inspection. It's still a very male orientated job. They undertake the exact same training at Rally. Go on, Hilton, speed it up, speed it up. But with a few extra rules. Your hair needs to be in a tight bun, just like mine. Makeup, not allowed in this rig, all right? The blokes aren't that attractive, <laughs> OK? And when it's your time of the month, it is not going to stop you training. I think sometimes it can be a little bit intimidating, but I, I personally don't think it's hard. I think that um, it's the 21st century and, you know, I didn't get my epaulets out of a cornflake box this morning. I earned them. Whilst the classes are mixed, the women live in a separate dormitory from the men. And I'm just like, woo! <laughs> In Cornwall Division, there's an unusually high number of female recruits. I remember the day I walked into the careers office and said, look, I want to join the Navy. I had, like, red acrylic nails on, red lipstick and, like, platinum blonde hair. <laughs> if somebody asked me, like, oh, what, what would Cara be doing? They would have never been like, yeah, joining the Royal Navy. <laughs> Yes, one day I would like to have a family. Yes, one day I would like to be a housewife, but I still want my own career. I still want to do what I want to do. The Cornwall recruits are over halfway through their training. I thought it was going to be a lot more difficult, actually. I don't think it's been as harsh as what everyone was telling me that it was going to be. I'm not doing this. I'm going to fall straight on my ass. There's generally quite a lull in week five, as in the standards start dropping in the mess. And I think it's mainly just because they, they start thinking, oh, I've got this in the bag. But what they don't realise is actually this is where training ramps up. The Cornwall recruits are entering the most physical stage of their training and their fitness sessions are being stepped up. Women get no special treatment. There's the standard. They have to meet it, whether they're male or female. You're praying to God for them to be kind. To the top! Hey! I am crap at fizz. <laughs> Francis, get off. Move. Get grip yourself. One, two. Every time I see the PT instructor, I'm just like, no, I want to go back to bed. It's quite intimidating. As soon as you've got a PTI on that wooden box in front of you all, it's daunting for all of them, male or female, even the fitter ones. But I like to watch it. <laughs> a lot of the time, the fizzes where you earn the respect from the guys. We just want to show them really that we can do what they can. I don't think I can run, but I smashed it. I beat some of the guys' time. <laughs>